Police in Rochester say they caught a suspected bank robber after following the paper trail he left behind. Authorities are looking into whether he might be connected to other bank robberies in western New York. News 4's Luke Moretti has a closer look at the case. Luke? Yeah, Jackie and Don, the FBI tells me the suspect was in the Buffalo area before the Rochester bank robbery. They say a trail of cash, video surveillance, and good old-fashioned police work led to a quick arrest. This is the man authorities say robbed a Rochester bank of nearly $110,000 in cash last week. Once he entered that bank, he provided a note that indicated that if individuals followed his instructions, nobody would die that day. According to the criminal complaint, Joseph Peoples III took money from the bank vault and that he even filled the bag himself with bundles of money. FBI special agent in charge, Adam Cohen. No weapon was displayed. It was um, done with that note. Authorities say Peoples took a cab to a bus station, leaving nearly $10,000 in a jacket he left in the taxi, and then dumped about $43,000 in the garbage inside the bus station's restroom, where he changed clothes. Cohen says at one point, Peoples checked into a Rochester hotel using his real name. So we were able to put the name with the individual at that point, and then it was a matter of tracing his movements. Cohen says the suspect eventually took a bus from Rochester, destined for New York City, but that's not where he ended up. From interviews, we were able to determine that he had actually uh, departed that bus in Binghamton. Authorities then tracked him to a hotel in Binghamton, where he was arrested on a federal bank robbery charge. We do know that Mr. Peoples has connections here in Buffalo and that prior to arriving in Rochester had been in the Buffalo area. We've not eliminated the possibility that Mr. Peoples uh, may have been involved in other bank robberies in the region and we will continue our investigation to determine if any facts bear that out. Now, according to the criminal complaint, Peoples told authorities that he hid about $50,000 in a microwave, in a shoebox, and plastic bag inside the hotel room in Binghamton. Luke Moretti. News 4.